Hello there, this is a quick introduction to cloud computing in the PixPro software. When we launch the software, we are greeted with local and cloud computing options, alongside lists of recent projects and cloud computing tasks. Processing a photogrammetry project is a heavy task for your computer. If you do not have a powerful machine, or just need it for other tasks until processing is completed, then the cloud computing option is for you. By clicking Cloud Computing, we can start creating our new project. Give your project a name, select the coordinate system, and click Next. Click on Import Photos. Photos Add Manager opens. By clicking Add Photos, we select a set of photos to add to our project. After adding the photos, we should check if all images are sharp, properly exposed, and relevant to the project. Then click OK. Now we can transfer the data to PixPro servers by clicking Upload. You can minimize, but do not turn off the software when the upload is in progress. After upload is complete, you are free to close the software. You will get an email notification when your project is ready to be downloaded. Click on Download. When the download is complete, the project becomes local. Now you can open the project and begin the task you had in mind. On the left hand side, we can see layers currently present in our project. Photos, point clouds, 3D mesh with textures, digital elevation map, orthophoto, and contour lines. Use the point tool to place points, mark and easily inspect photos containing the placed points. Edit point projections to make them as accurate as possible. Later, you can snap lines and polygons to these points for precise measurements. Use the line tool to measure distances, slopes and angles. Use the polygon tool to measure areas and volumes. All layers and placed objects in the PixPro software can be exported in a variety of formats for later use in other programs. This was just a small introduction to PixPro photogrammetry software. Dive deeper by reading our help documentation or checking out our blog. If you have any questions, contact us via one of our support channels. Happy processing!